watching the Corvette channel. When I was about 10, a neighbor of ours had a 67 Corvette. And to me, it looked like a spaceship. It was astonishing the sort of visual and emotional power that car had. Growing up, I really was a fan of the concept cars, like the Aerovet and the Corvette Indy. And in my mind, that was the obvious vision of where the Corvette needs to go to take it to the next level. The idea of a mid-engine Corvette goes all the way back to the early 60s. Zora Arkus Duntoff, he basically put Corvette on the map. He was mainly focused on absolute performance, nothing else. He lived at a time when the elite race classes were changing, shifting from front engine cars to engines placed behind the driver. You think of the history, the people, the mystique of the car. We're reaching back to the past, to these other automotive legends that started this journey. We're simply taking the baton and taking it across the finish line. One thing we knew when we started studying a mid-engine car in earnest was that it was possible to do a mid-engine car, but is it gonna be easy enough to live with? Is it gonna have a reasonable amount of luggage? Is it gonna be loud? You know, you got an engine inches behind you. So for us, it was like, how do we deliver that exotic hypercar experience and still make it feel uniquely Corvette? Corvette is more than just a vehicle. It's a lifestyle, it's a feeling, it's an element of passion that I think transcends not only time, but I think generations and cultures over the course of its life. The thing that was striking was when we parked the new car next to the old car. We weren't really appreciating the distinction between what we had, which was really excellent, and where we were going, which was really unbelievable. What's really gonna be exciting is this is gonna be the car for a new generation. When that 2020 Corvette Stingray hits the road, that's gonna be the car. Oh my gosh, it's the car I have to have. When the cars get out on the street and you see them in the real world, it's going to be like the reaction I had when I was about 10, where people will look at it and they just will not believe what they're seeing. Thank you for watching the Corvette channel. If you like what you saw today, please hit subscribe and hit the like button. Also, be sure to hit that bell so you will be alerted to our next uploads.